I'm looking at the Strava heat map. Uh, they, Strava enabled a new comparison allowing to look at the 2014 versus 2015 data on their global heat map. I'm focused in on uh, the eastern, uh, the kind of the Live Oak neighborhood of Santa Cruz, California, uh, where the cursor is right now. This is the Santa Cruz Harbor. Uh, this is Soquel Avenue right here, Capitola Road, Portola Drive. This is uh, Bromer Street, and Broadway is over here somewhere. So January 2015, um, a new bike path and bridge was open across the Arana Gulch area, which is this region right here uh, to the northwest of the harbor. Um, we're looking at the 2014 bike data as recorded by as, as it's uploaded to Strava. Um, so let's look at and see how things changed between 2014 and 2015. You can see it's pretty dramatic. Um, traffic increased significantly on Broadway as people were able to cut across um, on this new trail right here onto Bromer Street. So let me move that over again so you can see the difference. And it's and, and it's pretty dramatic. So once where there was no trail and now it's uh, this brand new trail and it's among the more popular bike routes for east-west travel um, across Santa Cruz or from Santa Cruz basically to Capitola. You can see that uh, traffic also increased a little bit. So here's Capitola Road um, or Capitola Drive from Soquel and increased a little bit. rather it decreased a little bit on Capitola Road. Um, and again, it increased a lot on Brahmer right here. Uh, I invite you to focus in on your city if you had a new bike facility somewhere. Um, see what kind of difference it made for your town.